Howdy do, and how are you, all you fine folks out there in internet land? Welcome back to another episode of the First Time Film Club. My name is Emily, the titular first timer. This is Matthew, my husband, Cinema Sherpa, and viewer submitted title Cinema Concierge. It's important to say it with all fancily. Oh, okay, okay. Concierge. Uh huh. Nice. You, yeah, you you do act as a concierge for me um, in so many ways. Sure. <laughs> if, uh, if you guys aren't familiar with the channel, what we're doing is there is a very long list of movies that I have never seen. Uh, Matthew has seen quite a lot of movies, so he's guiding me through that list, and we're checking them off one at a time. Mm -hmm. That being said, what are we checking off the list tonight? Uh, tonight we're going to be watching the 1984 comedy Police Academy. And as per usual, that's all I give you, name and genre. You go in with whatever knowledge you already have. You tell everybody what you know, then we watch, and then we review. So what do you know about this movie? So I know it's been requested a lot because apparently it, uh, a lot of our viewers think it's going to hit my particular sense of humor. Um, so I think it's going to be kind of silly, funny, slapsticky. The only thing that I really like, other than, you know, the name, Police Academy, is that I can't, I cannot remember the Winston, the guy who makes sound effects. He made the sounds on, uh, Spaceballs. I'm pretty certain that he comes from this movie. Okay. So, but that's that's about it. I don't um, I don't know the premise. I assume everybody's trying to get through police academy. Let's watch the movie. Okay, let's watch. <laughs> oh wait, before we watch, uh, just a reminder: this is actually the winner of the uh, Patreon poll. Oh, so, yeah. uh, if you do want to view the full length reaction of this, it's going to be available on our Patreon, which is uh, listed in the description below so sorry spiel out of the way <laughs> all right good deal now let's watch the movie for real <laughs> mm. completely freaked naturally very we're gonna miss you around here police academies get themselves a real fine recruit I, am I missing something? Did he draw a gun, or is it just the crazy eyes? Because that'll do it. Just a bit intense. Oh, they you have a gun. Bruh. <laughs> you couldn't even see what you're <gasps> <laughs> shooting. Well, Shoot first, ask listen. later. Oh. You've got a space. What's that hair? That's a wig, isn't it? <clears throat> park the car. Yeah, that's a wig. Wig! Wig! Yeah, I'm sorry, Lou. You just can't get good help these days. Oh. They don't respect respect. I mean, my name is Hell. Jesus! <laughs> Jesus! Found a spot. Oh. Damn thing fits! <laughs> I thought there were no more spaces. <laughs> why? Why? That's so cool. Why? Why you gotta mess up his cool little kiosk? Guys, I don't think I'm supposed to get the photos wet. See, that's not a cute prank. That's like massive property destruction. What are you in for? Show you. <laughs> <laughs> No, sir. No, not you. <laughs> Why can't you stay out of trouble? I mean... Because I want to come in and see that mustache. It is magnificent. Then I'll make a deal. I want you to go to the police again. It's either that or the lockup. So accident prone. Honey, don't worry. I'll be okay. Everything will be okay. <laughs> Dang, she need to join the academy. <laughs> Scene reminded me a lot of a uh, hot fuzz. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> what is that shirt? When I went through this academy. Every cadet was the right weight, the right height, the right color, and they all had Johnson's Lasard. Johnson? No. 
<laughs> oh, yes. Johnson! Back in the old days, there were Johnsons as far as the eye could see. And what a lovely sight it was. I'm sure a lot of spades around here. <laughs> yeah, say that again, please. Which I think is good. <laughs> what the hell are you doing here? I want to be a police officer. What? I can't hear you. Don't you dare be mean to her. <laughs> Work for the Academy Barber before you do anything else. Move the dirt bag on first. Take it all off. You got it. Uh, a little off the side, please. You bet. <laughs> you can do that? Sure. This ain't the army, you know. <laughs> Good haircuts, man. Good. I'm Copeland, sir. What? Chad Copeland. No. Mm -hmm. Good for you. <laughs> Of course, your name I, is Chad. Douglas Backler, I always wanted to see the top. <laughs> oh no, baby! <laughs> that wasn't very funny this morning. I wasn't trying to be funny. I'd give anything to see your thighs. <laughs> I suppose you'd describe them for me. Well, they look like thighs. Very supple, well rounded, and luxuriant to the touch. This is Sergeant Callahan! I want out of here, right now. Out of this office? No. <laughs> How did you get it? Can't quit. Of course you can. Many, many wonderful people have quit. Many, many. Come on. <laughs> Is he a Bridges? You're a special case. You can't quit. I'm trapped here? Yeah. Oh, yes. We all are. <laughs> oh, baby. <laughs> <laughs> it's the human condition. It's the human condition. <laughs> Problems call for modern solutions. Mm -hmm. Oh, I thought that was him saying beep, beep, beep. <laughs> no, that'd be great, though. <laughs> God, Morris! Chad, will you please just let me yell at him for a minute without interrupting? <laughs> <laughs> what were you expecting, my dude? <laughs> what the actual hell? Son, where did you get this gun? My mom gave it to me. <laughs> Can I borrow it for a little while? <laughs> <laughs> Can I see that, Mr. Psychopath? I need a volunteer. Barbara? I know. I, I just ate. <laughs> right here, right now. When she tells you to do something, you do it. Seems like not the best layout, you know. I didn't really think that through. <laughs> I got some extras. Do you? Would think? <laughs> okay. Oh, six pack. Mahoney. Nobody screws with me. Well, maybe you'll meet the right girl, and all that'll change. <laughs> if you don't mind, I do have to study. You know, Chad. I don't think we've got his full attention. So why don't you take his books, throw them out the window? <laughs> is there a party this weekend? Of course there is. Do you want to come? No, I can't. I just need to know where it is. At the uh, Blue Oyster Bar. Methinks that this is a setup. Why would you think such a thing? Mahoney's a pretty cool cat. He's hip. Oh god, it's a leather bar. Yes! <laughs> Oh no! Stay and have a chat, darling. Oh! Oh, titties! Titties! 
titties. <laughs> titties. <laughs> Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am! You're <laughs> 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 walking bow legged. <laughs> yes, ma'am. What do you say, hooks? No, this is my stick up. <laughs> Tackleberry. You try it. Same situation. Oh, God. He gonna get tackled. It's in his name. Not that stereo before I blow your goddamn nuts off, asshole! <sighs> we really need to talk. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Shit! That was good, Hightower. Don't you just sit down. <laughs> 30 minutes to room inspection. Mahoney, major problem. You want to do it in a podium. All my life. I think you'll find the presentation stimulating. <laughs> now this first slide. <laughs> very, very interesting thing. Main building. Let us look at this slide for a moment without commenting. I think it speaks for itself. This was as much fun for you as it was for me. Let's have lunch, shall we? <laughs> and a cigarette? Maybe. Smoke a cigarette. Pippin, don't look. What? Yes. Yep. Poor horse. <laughs> Talk about a horse's ass. Hmm. Move the seat back a little. And second thought, let's just rip the front seats out, sit in the back. <laughs> I was joking, but okay. Actually, I was kidding about the <laughs> comfort's important. No, not now. This is fun. Feel like you're gonna pass just fine. Not bad, Miss Hooks. I <laughs> hit him with the Wii. Oh, hit him with the tires. That's why he said behind the yellow line. Sorry, I really am. Sorry, you dumb fat jigaboo. <gasps> Is right. Hata, don't do that, Hata. If you don't stop, you are out of here. Got off easy, my dude. You messed up, bitch. Mahoney. <laughs> it's gotta be Mahoney. You wrecked my car. So 
Hightower did. I'm gonna rub this right in your face. On your mark, get set. <laughs> First off, that's basically tinfoil. If that knocked him out, he... Yeah. Mm. That's incredibly wasteful. Oh lord. Oh lord. <laughs> Just like that. Time to write. This goes to show. Apples are no good for anybody. That's not true. Real police are handling the problem. We are being sent to a peripheral safe area. Boy, it sure is quiet around here, huh? <laughs> what the hell are you doing here? You're supposed to be blocks away from here. The damn ride's right back down the street. Whoop! <laughs> well, man, how's it going? I want you to give me a fix on the entire situation. Not that good, sir. <laughs> oh! oh. oh. <laughs> very, very bad. <laughs> <laughs> Roll him up! <laughs> <laughs> nice sound effects save the day. Oh, that's a deep V, and I'm about it, my dude. Please let the fence come to an end. Yes. <laughs> Tempting. Uh oh. Uh oh. Always look behind you, babe. Don't move, you bastard. Put the gun down. Say you put your gun down. Ken Harris, any last minute tips or suggestions? Nothing really comes to mind. <laughs> hey! Woo! <laughs> Found her outside voice. Commandant of the Academy, Eric Lassard. <laughs> what are you looking at the podium? So many unusual events have happened. We're both expected to make a few short remarks. Officer, I tell. Thanks. <laughs> My kind of Perfect. Speech. Officer Mahoney. Oh boy. Thank you, Commandant Lassard, Chief Perth, Madam Mayor, Mr. President. Mm -mm. His Holiness the Pope, King of Norway, and our other honored guests. <laughs> <laughs> so, that was Police Academy. Overall thoughts? That was a good time. <laughs> oh, man. Um, <laughs> I love all the characters. Like, all of the um almost all of the cadets um you know i Except didn't love the ones that you were supposed to dislike um <laughs> i love winslow mm -hmm. just so good <laughs> <laughs> yeah he uh i think it was the director or producer i can't remember uh somebody saw his act it was like they were at a comedy club and like the lights went out and he went and got a megaphone from the fire marshal that was on site and did his whole set through a megaphone and like brought the house down. So they were like, we need to get this guy in the movie. Yeah. So they wrote his part in like after the fact, after they had it all in. <laughs> nice. Nice. Uh, now this was a friggin' riot, man. Um, the podium. Oh, yeah, that's. <laughs> yeah. That would probably be my favorite scene. I mean, the, it's just. The podium with uh, Commandant Lassard. So, is he a Bridges. Who, who, who is the guy who plays him? Uh. Oh, Lord. It's something Gaines, I believe. I can't. I'm blanking right now. It's been a long day. George Gaines. That's George it. Gaines. I'm gonna have to look and see what else he's in because he looks, 
he seems familiar, but he reminds me of like a combination of uh, Daddy Bridges, Lloyd. Lloyd Bridges, and Leslie Nel Leslie Nielsen. If they had like a love child, I feel like it's him. <laughs> but no, I've really enjoyed him. Like his voice, he said, "I just want to get out of here." Don't we all? <laughs> Don't we all? This is a a hard rewatch. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah. Um, I can't, I can't tell you how many times I've seen this movie. This was, <laughs> this is one of my older brother's like favorite movies. So I've seen it quite a few times mm -hmm. in my childhood. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get your rating on this. I'm gonna say this is like it's like an eight point nine for me. Like overall, I really enjoyed it. Eight point nine, I think is. Like... All right. I'm trying oh, I'm sorry, to be a I, little more I... critical okay. in my assessments, so. Gotcha. And an 8.9 is critical for you? Y yes, because I really <laughs> liked it. Okay. Well, you, you, know, uh, you rate it what you rate it. I do, I did. That's the number. Okay. Done did it. Uh, did you have a favorite scene or anything you wanted to talk about? I mean, the podium bit was hilarious. Yeah. Um, I love... <laughs> <laughs> ripping the car seats out like just the face um pretty much anything well, i was just kidding <laughs> i was like well i mean but this is good comfort is important <laughs> it is important um about the blue oyster the blue oyster <laughs> made me so happy those two didn't make it right like i don't remember no seeing i'm pretty sure they got and... kicked out because they lost their revolvers yeah I thoroughly enjoyed that. And then that they went back in there. It's just like, yes, good job. There was a lot of titties in this movie. I was yeah, pleasantly they, surprised. They wanted it to be pretty... Uh, raunchy? Raunchy. <laughs> More on the crude side. I'm, a, I'm about it. I think that's probably one of the reasons this movie speaks to me. Um, but yeah, what about you? Uh, yeah, the, the podium scene would have been my favorite scene. It's... <laughs> Hilarious. I mean, I mean, yeah, I love... Slide! <laughs> yeah, he was great. Uh, Gutenberg as Mahoney. Funny. But... I'm sorry, I just have to say this because it kept, it, I kept thinking about it. He reminds me, like, he favors my dad in a way. Like, he sort of, like, looks like my dad a little. Um, so when I first saw him, I was like... Mm -hmm. But, yeah, that was kind of weird so, for me. <laughs> uh when this movie came out, mm -hmm. you know, uh, Roger Eber? The thumbs up guy? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm He gave this movie zero stars. Why? Uh, I think the quote was, if it's the only thing, it's something, it's something along the lines of, it's the only thing worse than a movie that uh, fails the punchline or doesn't deliver a punchline or doesn't deliver on the punchline as a movie that doesn't even bother to put in a punchline yeah he would as far as like commercial success and uh, grossing money mm -hmm. he was wrong mm -hmm. this movie I think it was like somewhere between four million and some odd mm -hmm. like dollar budget and like it's opening weekend it made eight, eight million but then over its course and over worldwide, it's like a hundred and sixty something million, hundred eighty something million. I can't remember exactly. Somebody will know in the comments and correct me on that. <laughs> uh, but it was a, it was a lot. It spawned. There are seven total police academy movies. They I don't know if we'll ever get to all seven. Uh, Winslow was Winslow and Gaines. And I think there's one other person that were the only three actors that were in all mm. seven movies. It also had a uh, TV series, mm -hmm. live action, and animated. Mm -hmm. So yeah, it was it became very very popular. Yeah, suck on that thumb, <laughs> Ebert. Uh, I'll show you I'll show you this later. And for anybody else who wants to watch it, there's a really cool. YouTube channel called Good Bad Flicks. Yeah, Good that, uh, Bad Flicks. Yeah, he's really awesome. Does a lot of great like in-depth behind-the-scenes mm -hmm. stuff, and he did a video uh, exploring Police Academy that it's really good. I'll show you that later. Okay. If anybody else is interested in, I would highly recommend going checking out because he's got 
if you're into like uh you know behind the scenes production stuff stories and it's like it's like a little mini documentary yeah. on movies all within a uh, like 15 20 minute video it's really good very well done yes very well done all right well what would you write it then if i was rating this uh yeah oh, you were gonna say five i was like bitch get out <laughs> Uh, no, it was a four. No, I'm just kidding. Just kidding. Okay. <laughs> Pippin, you can live with mommy now. We're gonna get the support. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he says, I don't care. Whoever pets just me and feeds me. me. Love you, love you. Uh, no, if I was rating it, I'd probably give it a eight to an eight and a half. Somewhere right there. Okay. It's funny. Rewatchable. I mean, like I said, I've seen it countless times and I still, still laugh at it. Yeah, he's a fuzzy little chonker. Fuzzy boy. Okay, that's that's. I'll allow that. Oh, you That's are. a respectable. Oh, okay. It's a gentleman's eight point five. <laughs> <laughs> well, anything else, my dude? No, I think I think that covers it. Okay. Um. Well, guys, thank you so much for hanging out. You know, we, me specifically, I think. Uh, love these kinds of movies, and we're always really happy that we get to share, share. Mm -hmm. Gotta shear ya. Okay. Need to shear Pippin. Um, oh. he, he needs a, a deep brushing. Uh, yeah. We're always happy to share this with <laughs> you guys. Um, if you don't mind, please like the video. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. And if you've got nothing else, Pippin, do you have any input? Oh, it's good. It's good. Just good last words. Uh, we'll see you guys next time with another first time. Bye. Bye.